Hey you guys, so I thought I'd do a little throwback of a grocery haul. You guys know I used to do, the, well if you've been a long term watcher, I used to do grocery hauls all the time and for some reason I just stopped. Um, I needed to do like a little weekly restock for me and the kids. Like I said, my husband is not here right now, so it's just the four of us. And you guys, this little bit of stuff was over $200. Like, are you joking me? I'm sick right now. Like, that's insane to me. Grocery prices are crazy, but... We have to eat so let's just go ahead and jump into this haul so over here i had to grab some paper towels we we're all out of those i needed some more lysol wipes i am i have to have these in my house at all times clorox lysol doesn't matter i need um disinfecting wipes in my house at all times um i grabbed these little carnation um high protein breakfast drinks madeline and eli they really like these on days where they're just not like craving something to eat for breakfast they can just have one of these little essentially it's just like a protein smoothie type of thing so i like to get those for the kids um i needed more pancake mix because i think i'm gonna make pancakes for the kids tomorrow for breakfast um i grabbed some more cup noodles i have some more over here they just kind of got mixed up um i grabbed them some applesauce for snacks for school they got some lucky charm uh cereal bars these were like six dollars for 16 bars that's crazy anyways i also grabbed these little nutri-grain bars these are the apple and carrot i like that they have some vegetables in it probably not hardly anything but i don't know it made me feel better to buy something <laughs> with some veggies in it and eli he really likes those um over here i got some fruit snacks again little hidden veggies in there like i said probably not much of anything at all but i don't know feel a little bit better about buying those i grabbed some juices for their their lunch boxes for the week um i grabbed them some pringles i haven't bought pringles in so long um they'll probably eat these by the end of the night they go through pringles really fast um i grabbed some ranch seasoning seasoning ranch dressing here's the ranch seasoning i'm gonna make a pot roast and <laughs> y'all tell me why i freaking forgot the pot roast like that was one of the main reasons why i went in there and i did not grab the pot roast so uh sometimes this week i'm gonna have to go back to the store and buy more stuff that i forgot because i don't know sometimes i get really bad anxiety in the grocery store and i just my mind like goes blank and i forget a lot of stuff so that was one of the things that i forgot i grabbed some hamburger buns we're gonna do burgers one night this week i grabbed this little cheese it um snack mix for the kids hopefully they like those i had to re-up on my cokes i have been on a little coke kick lately and i've just i don't know i don't have it every day but i've just I've been craving them and then when I want one I don't have any in the house so just grab some to keep in the house um over here I grabbed our favorite pretzels these are the only pretzels the kids will eat the thin ones these are so good I love these too so I had to get the party size those are very expensive too like six dollars for this bag which is crazy insane to me um I was craving some orange juice so I wanted to get some of that <laughs> y'all and I have not had coffee probably in over a month and a half now I have just been giving up coffee because like i said i think it's like linked to my anxiety but last week i bought some pumpkin spice creamer and i forgot the coffee and i've just been craving coffee you guys so i really hope this doesn't like trigger my anxiety but i went ahead and just got it so we'll see how that goes but i've been craving like a pumpkin spice iced coffee so grab that um i got some dumplings you guys if you guys have been watching tiktok you know these are kind of viral on tiktok right now i don't not this exact brand is viral but just dumplings in general that you put in the microwave and you put like soy sauce um honey crunch not honey crunch like chili onion crunch some type of stuff you put on it i don't have any of that but i have soy sauce and sriracha so i'm gonna try these out one day this week and i'll let you know how those are um i just grabbed some frozen meals for the kids they can take this for lunch during the week i can put it in their little new omi box i can just heat it up and then heat these up and put them inside their little box uh over here i grabbed some bacon um for breakfast and like for the burgers this week and some ground beef i don't know what this is for i think i'm gonna do pasta with that um yeah and i grabbed some american cheese over here i grabbed some sandwich meat for the kids i grabbed some frozen mixed veggies over here i got some shredded cheese i just like to keep this in the house um y'all these are so freaking good these are expensive like five dollars for this little box but um these are so good like if you have seen these in your store definitely try them they're so good you don't toast them you can but i don't eat them toasted you just thaw them out for like five minutes and they're so good so if you see these definitely try them out it's like a thick belgian style waffle but like you can eat it cold i don't know it's just really good i wanted to try it and they're good um i grabbed some frozen 
corn on the cob over there. I got some of the ground beef burgers. Um, I don't know if this brand is good. I've never tried it, so we'll see how that is. I grabbed some frozen pancakes for the kids for breakfast. Um, I also grabbed a frozen pizza. This pizza is so good. I've seen this brand before since being here, and I tried it one day, and it is so good. You get like a little seasoning packet in there. And I don't know, this tastes like like a, a pizza you get from like a restaurant or something. It's so good. So I don't know if this is just like a commissary brand, or I don't know if you guys have seen this brand before, but it's really good frozen pizza. And then over here, the kids have been loving these little icy cups. These are like um, basically Italian ice. And the kids have been loving these so i grabbed the blue raspberry and watermelon their favorite junior has been loving like mango flavored things so i want to grab him the mango one and that's just like a little sweet dessert treat for them i also grabbed myself some true fruit you guys i've been on a little true fruit kick right now i've tried the yogurt parfait ones um i've never tried this one this one is pina colada it has like pineapple what does it say white chocolate and coconut bro i know these are gonna be so good i love anything pina colada those are gonna be so good. I also grabbed the um, the banana, chocolate, and peanut butter. Oh my God, like, I just know these are gonna be so good. It's just like a little healthier, I'm not gonna say healthy, but just probably like a better dessert option. Let me see, um, protein, three grams, 100 calories for two, oh wait, for two pieces, 100 calories. Yeah, that's definitely not healthy, but whatever it is what it is i want to try it in the commissary once they get things in sometimes they sell out and they'll never get it ever again so i wanted to grab it and just try it and we'll see how that is um i grabbed some watermelon overpriced what was that 5.49 for this little bit of chopped up watermelon but i was craving some and it's just like these prices are just ridiculous i don't know uh, I grabbed a random a cucumber. Madeline has been loving cucumbers with her lunches, and I use it sometimes, too. Um, I grabbed some eggs. Let me see. Over here, I got some little utensils for the kids. Uh, lunch boxes, some spoons, and forks. And then last but not least, I grabbed myself some flowers, you guys. I'm not, like I said, my husband's not here right now, and he can't buy me flowers, so... I've just been treating myself like every two weeks I'll buy myself some flowers. Um, if you saw my latest video, I got this cute little purse uh, flower pot dish thing. And I just thought these would be really cute in it. And I'm going to put these inside like a big, um, like a taller uh, flower. What am I saying? A flower base. That's what I mean to say, not a flower pot. But yeah, that is my grocery haul. Over $200 for this little bit of stuff. Like I said, I am sick. I hate going to the grocery store at this point because I just... This little bit of stuff, and I only got two meats. Like, that's crazy to me. But yeah, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this grocery haul. Um, maybe I'll do some more in the future. I've just, these prices just have me, they give me an attitude. I don't know. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.